one fell right off. Okay. Look at that. Pretty plumped. Oh. Oh, that guy's not ready. This guy's pretty small. All right, guys, let's talk about lime pods. The lime quad is a cross between a key lime and the original kumquat. Um, for the taste, it is sweet and sour. The rind is sweet. The inside is really juicy and sour. It's great in cooking. I love it with uh, I love it with my fish, mainly my salmon, and it's fantastic in adult beverage if you choose to drink. Um, for us here, my husband and I, we just eat it straight off the tree. It's just a great source of vitamin C. And I think everybody should own one of this, this awesome lime quad tree or any kumquat tree as a matter of fact. But um, if you like the sourness and you don't wanna grow a massive big lemon or lime tree, please try one of these. So are they better in the ground or in a pot? Well, I have two trees. I have one that is in the ground, which is that one right there. This guy doesn't really get all day sun. It gets, hmm, it gets afternoon and evening sun. And this guy right here, this guy is in a 20 gallon pot. There's a pot there. And every year I have to pretty much put new soil because as you guys already know, the pot here has holes on the bottom and the soil tends to, well, seep right out. So what type of soil do I use? Potting soil. Or you can use the um, citrus mix, which is wonderful. This guy has been in this pot for going on three years now. As you can see here, there's not really that much fruit production, but there's some. And there's some that's about to ripe and there are more coming. Look at all those little babies. This guy that's in the ground here has been in the ground for three and a half years the leaves are a little yellow right now which is pretty normal around this time there's quite a few more fruits than the tree that's in the pot and if you look at the fruit size they're pretty ginormous for lime pots that guy right there is pretty big can't reach it um so let's talk about fruit production and fruit size. I've noticed that the tree that's in the ground produce way more fruits than the tree that's in the pot. As for the fruit size, here's a look at the fruit that I just picked from the tree that's in the ground and take a look at some of the fruit size or the fruits of the tree that's in the pot. As you can see here, the fruit for the tree that's in the pot is way smaller than the fruit from the tree that's in the ground. Way smaller. Again, this tree that's in the pot has been in the pot for three years. Oh, say hello, Jacob. No, no hello. Anywho, the tree that's in the ground here has been in the ground for three and a half to four years. And again, if you don't have a lot of space, you can definitely grow one of these lime pots in a pot. You will get fruits, just not as big and as many as the tree that is in the ground.